He's the most prominent person ever to be charged under Beijing's sweeping and controversial security law. On Friday, 73-year-old media mogul Jimmy Lai was charged on suspicion of colluding with foreign powers and endangering national security. Lai is the owner of Hong Kong's biggest selling paper, Apple Daily, a tabloid that is unashamedly pro-democracy and fiercely critical of authorities. He was arrested in August along with a string of others after police raided the newspaper's headquarters. Lai has been a vocal figure in the fight for democracy for years. The vaguely worded security law under which Lai has been charged outlaws secession, subversion, terrorism and collusion with foreign forces to intervene in Hong Kong's internal affairs. It was brought in in June after a year of massive pro-democracy protests rocked the city, prompting Beijing to clamp down on the semi-autonomous region. Leaders around the world worry the law will be used to silence pro-democracy forces, but Beijing denies this. The implementation of the national security law will only allow Hong Kong residents to enjoy more social stability, economic development and greater freedom. If found guilty, Lai could face life in prison. His case is the latest in a wide crackdown on pro-democracy figures. Recently, Joshua Wong, a leading activist in the movement, was jailed for 13 months for organizing what authorities called an unlawful assembly. Others have been charged for throwing the Chinese national flag on the floor or shouting pro-democracy slogans at police.